Okay, yes. yeah, like, yeah, I we think. all, so, yeah, 3.10 facts mm -hmm. versus opinion, right? Yes, okay. facts versus opinion. I, I think this, this is the last. Yes. Facts is a statement that can be proved true or false in an opinion, it's an, it's an expression. Pursuing feelings that cannot be proven can be based on facts or emotions. Sometimes they are men deliberately mislead others. So basically... Hey, I see that you don't waste time, guys. That's great. Good evening, sir. Good evening. <laughs> happy Father's Day. <laughs> hey, happy Father's Day to everybody. Thank you very much for being here. <laughs> Uh, well, even though it's Father's Day. So, thank you very much, guys. Let's go ahead and start a new class. As you all know, what was yesterday's topic, guys? Yesterday's topics, we were talking about yeah. assumptions, nouns, assumptions, mm -hmm. uh, criticism, demands, excuse, predictions, suggestion, mm -hmm. suspicion, and warning. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice, nice. All right. So um, by today, guys, I'm, I'm going to change it a little bit. By today, we should be finishing the midterm exam. All right, because okay. despite tomorrow, we only have one more week of classes. And you know it's Monday through Thursday. So I want to know how you're doing with the platform right now. I am already in 5.3, I think. Okay. And tomorrow, from tomorrow, I'm going to start working on that. All right. And I'll do my best. You know? And if I made some mistake before in the other, in the other lessons, I would like to fix them. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very I much. I see. I see. I'm on, on 3.7. Knowledge check. Mm, okay. 3.7. Plus model. Plus model. I'm, I, I, I think I'll get it up today tomorrow. Okay. Very good. And what about the rest? Hey, Anaida, a couple of uh, days without In my you. case, <laughs> hello, in my case, uh, I am late, teacher, because I am in a 2.6, because I, I, I was working in the, for two days in the night. Mm, okay, you were working at night. I, I, I think that the, the last weekend, I am ready. <laughs> okay, so you will, you will be ready. You, you will be ready. Okay, all right, very good. Um, guys, if you ever have an issue with the, with, the, um, with the platform, let me know if there's any technical issue. Because, okay. as I mentioned, I'm going to say it again. Mm -hmm. Next Thursday is going to be mm -hmm. the last day, and uh, you're supposed to be, like, you know, getting, being up to date with the platform. You need to achieve at least 80% so you can, you can approve the course. Right, and you okay. can be enrolled in the next ones. So, if any hey. type of question, send you it mean, to the group. You mean the last, the last Thursday? Next, the la, next, next Thursday, okay. next one. So next mm -hmm. week is gonna be the last week, uh -huh. and after that, uh -huh. we're gonna be waiting for the. Oh, what is the? ¿Cómo se dice esto? Mm -hmm. uh, for the next module. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, no diploma, we, diploma, diploma. Oh, yeah, <laughs> the diploma. When, when you say module... Okay. Uh -huh. When you say module, I, I hear like module. Module, that's right. Module. 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 And, yeah, okay. Okay. and we'll be waiting for the next module. Hopefully, we will be able to participate, right? Mm -hmm. Hopefully. Okay, good. Yeah, and it's going to be always online, right? Yes, yes, good. it will. I'm, good, good. Yeah. I, I think nobody wants to see other people around. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. For now. So, for now. For now, exactly. So, let's get mm -hmm. it ready. Let's get started today. As you know, every time that we start a new unit, we start with um, listening skills. Okay? So, okay. let's go ahead and pay attention to the, today's video. We are going to discuss it and then we move to the next topic. Let's go ahead and mute your mics. Pay attention, because as you know, I will be asking for some questions after the video.
Keep on watching these videos, they give you a preview of what this section will be about. My name is Matthew Hawks and I'm a singer-songwriter. Making music is my creative outlet. The way I make sense of the world around me. When I sit down to compose, the first thing I do is tune my guitar. Once the guitar is tuned up and ready, I set up the keyboard. Set up the keyboard. The keyboard has multiple functions and multiple sounds. What comes out of me is a reflection of how I'm feeling that day. Sometimes I can spend hours writing one piece. I'm writing this song. I titled it Revelations. When I sit down to write, one of the things I like to use most is a thesaurus. I started with a one word, Revelations. I look it up in a thesaurus, and I could have ten words then, each with a different sound, each offering a different rhyme scheme for me. As I When I feel I've taken my song as far as I can, I then bring it to a recording studio. I think it's important to get feedback and ideas from other musicians. Aldous Collins is a guitarist and a friend. He accompanies me in the recording studio. At the studio, we work with a recording engineer. I'm Richard Marr, I'm a recording engineer. My job is to capture music of a band. I go around and mic everything up, it comes through my board, and it's recorded into the computer system here, the multi-track recorder. All right, guys, roll it. One, two, three. The recording engineer mixes all the vocals and instruments together. Recording your music can actually teach you a lot. You hear your own music differently. Revelation. It changes your perspective, and you notice all kinds of things that you didn't when you composed the song. At the end of the recording session, I have a digital file of my song. I take my songs to radio stations and try to get them to play them on the air to build an audience for my song and my music. Hi, my name is Melanie Oliver. I'm the program director here at the radio station. The program director's job is to decide what music is played on air. So I pick the songs and tell the DJs what songs to play. Hey, Josh, come on in. Hey, Melanie. Hey. So I've picked the three songs that we're going to use for the local music show. Okay, here's some background information. Great. One of the artists' name is Matthew Hawks. Okay. The song is called Revelations. It's going to be a really good song, so I think you should play it on your show. Great. I look forward to playing it. Great. Thank Th you. Thank you. My name is Josh McBride, and I'm a DJ right here at the radio station. The main responsibility of a DJ is to play music on the radio. Other responsibilities include adjusting the volume, speaking with listeners, conducting contests, and reading commercials. Here's a new one from a Boston local. Matthew Hawks did this one. This is Revelations right here on WERS. And now, people all over the world can download it too, which is so cool. If you want to download it, look me up. My name is Matt Hawks. Revelation 
at www.matthawks.com. And the song is Revelations. Enjoy. All right, guys. So, um, what do you think? How do you feel the difference between this video and the previous one, as far as the uh, the speed they used to talk? It's a little bit faster. The and describe different type of people. Like uh, they basically mm -hmm. first we have the Matthew, who he is a music musician, and he starts telling telling us about describing what he does okay and then we can hear the we, about the record studio there, what are the jobs what do they do there we go uh, first and, question first question what is the first step because we have a, a couple of professions right here which are the professions that you or occupations that you were able to identify uh record studio and we have a mm, but that's a place uh, yeah, sounds yeah. a recording engineer. Re recording, recording engineer. engineer. Uh -huh. engineer. A DJ. Uh, a program DJ. Direct, program director. Program director. A the musician. The, the composer. Musician. Uh -huh. musician. Musician and composer. That's right. Composer. And what is the first thing he does when when he's about to play and compose? Matthew is the writer. Song. Matthew. Matthew. Mm -hmm. and he, uh, that, that was right at the beginning. I wrote the song. Mm. Mm. No, he tuned. He at, at the beginning he tune uh, tune the the guitar, uh -huh. set the he tunes set the, the keyboard. Uh -huh. He tunes the guitar, set the keyboard. That's right. Set the keyboard. And then after he start to to write down the the, the lyrics and uh -huh. then try to play it, to put some music to those lyrics. That's it's, right. But it's, it's kind of weird because. Uh, it should be, in my opinion, it should be. You sh you you could um, uh, compose first, uh, write write down the lyrics, and then after uh, tune your to to put the music, you have to tune the your guitar and mm -hmm. set your keyboard. Yeah, I guess that uh, different it, musicians it, have different. Uh, sure. The music. My question. Mm -hmm. <coughs> uh, in this case, sorry, what's sorry. the mean of tone a guitar? To tune is um. Afinar. Eso. Afinar that thing. Oh, okay. Afinar la guitarra. But okay. he's, of course, Christian music, no? Uh, the, because of the name, I think so. What's the name of the song? Revelation. 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 That's right. So after he get, he finishes, you know, with his music composing. What does he do? What is the next step? He goes to the record station. He goes to the recording studio. That's right. Recording. Mm -hmm. What is what is uh, what do they do there? I mean, uh, work with the recording engineer uh -huh. and record with the computer system, mm -hmm. and basically, um, what they do is they how do you say grabar? Record, record. So they re they record all the music and uh, work with the with his friend Alex, the guitar. He's a friend of him, and they work together to make the song. Uh, somebody will help me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and um, what happens when he, he has the song recorded? They put, also... they, they put together all the, the vocals and the sounds, and the, they start making the, the music. Uh -huh. Sounds right, you know, look. The sounds different when you know the, the, the uh, when he did it when he made it in the, in the beginning. Mm -hmm. It's the sounds different when he's already you know like um and uh, um when they they use uh, the um, the engineer uh, he, he mix all the vocals and and, and lyrics. Yep, he and, mixes and the, the vocals. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the music sound like the song sounds different, right? Uh, you know, if like actually, actually, actually uh -huh. give me uh, Julio. I I hear you very far away. Check what is failing. 
he checks what's failing, that's right, to fix the mistakes. And now Apparently, he, he discovers some details that uh -huh, he, haven't re he, he hasn't realized before, exactly. before recording it mm -hmm. together. Now, he, also, he already has the song. What mm -hmm. happens next? He goes to the radio station. Okay. And so who is the person? Who is the person who decides? Melanie, uh, Melanie, the, the program director. director. Mm -hmm. program, uh, okay. Program director. Yeah. The, and the what she happens then? The songs. What is it gonna be in the sounding? The, the, the radio. Pro, mm -hmm. the program director talks with the DJ. Exactly. Talks with the DJ. In order for what? Used to, to tell play the, the music on the radio. radio. Uh -huh. To play the radio. To play the music on the radio. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which, which songs are going to play in the radio? Okay. okay. Great. So um, now we ha I have a couple of so questions easy. to... Before we go with, to, uh, to today's topic, we're going to talk a little bit about music and about the radio, about both. I wanted to talk about music, if music has an impact in your life. In my case, I'm surrounded by musicians, most likely metal, rock, etc., because that's the kind of music I listen to. And uh, but I, I do not play any musical instrument, so that's like a shattered dream, right? Because I never took the time. Shattered dream. Shattered dream. What do you say? Shattered dream. Okay. Shattered. Okay. Shattered. Okay. Shattered. okay. In my so, case, I listen. I listen to music, and like you said, we have different type of music. It depends mm -hmm. on how we feel. And in my case, mm -hmm. it depends how I feel at the moment. I am Christian, so I listen mm -hmm. to a lot of Christian music. But sometimes right. I listen to relaxing music. I listen to any. I listen to. Um, and and that's exactly what I wanted to talk about, guys. I'm gonna open up the break rooms. I wanted to talk about the impact in, of music in your life. And also, because it's related, to talk about the radio. If you're Salvadorian and older than what, 20? I guess that you heard, no se puede vivir sin radio. I don't mm -hmm. know if you remember that. I remember. Uh -huh. And I was cooking today and I, I remember of that. I don't listen this to radio is... anymore. Mm -hmm. This is slogan. This slogan is uh, uh, is is uh, actually put on the radio. Is it is it a still uh, being played? Yet, yes, yes. I, I, I hear. It. Okay. I hear it. Playing. All right. So I wanted to go ahead and accept the invite and talk about that about music, how music has impacted your life, and what about the radio? Go ahead, accept the invite. Okay. I'll be visiting you, one by one. Hey, Adri, did you get the, the invite? Hello? Adri? All right, in case you can hear me, I'm going to keep an eye on you. In the meantime, I will check the group. <laughs> what, what decade? What decade? The 80s decay or 90s decay? 90s. 90s yeah. <laughs> but what what groups? I mean, what decade? A decade, decade. decade. Uh -huh. yeah. So it, it was no. Megadeth or or Mudri Crew or what was Ah, Pantera. Okay. Guns and Roses. Are you a rocker? Yeah, like a... Are you a rocker, Francisco? Yeah, I used to be, no. Okay, okay. How old are you, Francisco? 44. 44. How old? I am, I am 44 years old. 34, 34. 44. I'm 44. 40. I'm 40. I'm 46. Yeah. And I and I believe oh. the I believe the rock rock is is a kind of uh, how to say uh, it's a kind of moda. It's a it's a trend. Yeah. 
it's a trend in your life and, and some some time i mean some time in your life you are a rocker I, actually i many oh, wow. friends of mine were rockers uh, but I, I started to like uh -huh. the music, but I, I hear rock in maybe in the 80s, in the 80s. Yeah, but like I Iron think, Maiden, ACDC, all those. I think those. it depends. Uh, you, you call uh -huh. it a trend. To some people, it is a trend, like to my nephew. But uh -huh. to me, I mean, I, I still listen to that kind of music. I mean, I listen okay. to uh -huh. other kinds of music, but uh -huh. I mean, uh -huh. as Francisco was mentioning, Pantera, Guns N' Roses, Maiden, and oh, yeah. Yeah. you know, and heavier Metallic. music. All right, I like the fact that you're talking. Let me go ahead and check how other groups are doing. <laughs> okay, Continue, thank you. guys. All right. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Beautiful music. In my case, I I feel uh, happy. I feel with peace because the the I prefer to listen. You feel peaceful. Uh, yes, uh -huh. yes. Peaceful or in peace too. In peace. Mm -hmm. Uh, in peace? No. Mm -hmm. In peace. In peace. In peace. I um, uh, five years ago, I, I, I listen uh, romantic music, young music. Um, I all the time I feel sad. I feel what do you say, nostalgica? Mm -hmm. Nostalgic? No, no, I, I don't know. Home, well, give me a second. Homesick is some sort of nostalgia, but let me go ahead and look for it here. The beautiful <laughs> thing is we have internet to double check. I, I feel sad so sometimes uh, when I began uh, to listen to music. Hey, listen, what? Nostalgic. Nostalgic. Not that I, I, all the time I felt nostalgic when I, I listened to uh jazz music when i listen g. when i listen to jazz music yep nostalgic that's right nostalgic nostalgic mm -hmm. kenny g tony braxton and uh kenny g is, is very very nostalgic music i in, in um i changed uh, the music uh, when i began, began uh, to listen christian music i feel i feel i i i am feeling very 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 happy, very, um, very, very, poquito más suave, uh, very, very, uh -huh. very, very happy, very well. Um, I, I, I love the Christian music. Uh, Hilson is a, a nice group. I, I recommend them to, to listen to the, the, the kind of music because it's a, a, a good music. In, it's a, a very, very famous band. But, uh -huh, very famous. 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 Mm -hmm. famous band in the world. Okay, I like all types of music, but not the last uh, music, stereo uh, band. No, I don't like it. <laughs> in my case, I understand it. <laughs> I, in my case, I was telling to my partner that I like almost all the genders like different kind of music sometimes uh, i go to the disco and you know that when you go to the disco you are not able to pick the song and you have to listen everything however i like cumbia reggaeton perreo <laughs> uh, rock <laughs> uh, bachata but i hate I, uh, me too i like the, the salsa type music Continue, yeah. guys. Let me check another. Salsa. Do, do, do you? A rock. Uh, no hard rock, but but for rock, uh, like. How well? How well do you rock? play the guitar? How well? Um, I I don't have. A, I don't know. Uh, I not. Uh, in a scale to one to ten, how? Uh, I I I'm, in a scale, I I think uh, seven or eight. Really? Yes, wow, that's Very great. Good. Yeah. Yes. But I, I mean, yeah. But I don't don't uh, uh, Do you know a know. song in a specific? Do you play a song in a specific? A song in a specific. Any specific song, song that you any like? Specific or like uh yes, uh, like uh It's all stereo or something like that. Something like that in English um uh, Maybe uh, Eric Clapton, uh, like 
I don't know okay. if you hear cocaine ah. or or, or jump the of the Van Halen or um, Creedence. Creedence. I don't know. I, 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 there there is a Creedence. Yeah, Creedence. Yeah, Creedence. Yeah, Creedence. Yeah, Creedence is good. This guy who played the who sings uh, cocaine and whiskey. What's his name? Oh, yeah. Feeling with cocaine and whiskey. Uh, yeah. No, mm -hmm. I haven't heard that. <laughs> I don't remember that, but, 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 but I know what I it is. I put your picture, picture away, something like that. But yeah, uh, but it's a good song. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. But... The, the, the music is, is, a, is a, um, a good thing of, to, for relax. Yeah, and yeah. it's a way for yeah. people to communicate. You know, it's a yeah. good way to, and sometimes that is, that's the way they communicate to other people uh, according to how they feel at the moment. They play a yeah. song and and that's a good way to. Yeah, it's a yeah. good way to express your feelings, Ex your express emotions. Your feelings. Exactly. exactly. It's, and it's nice you that you, Arturo, you can yeah. play uh, the guitar and other instruments and that it's nice. Yes, yes exactly. Uh, it's, it's, it's a good... Uh, it's a good hobby. I, I think you you don't you don't feel the time run. Yeah, I wish when I, I could when play I, the guitar, I, but I I don't know. My, my, my wife sometimes. Young. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, still he's, young he's young. He's young. He has. You have a long way to go, my friend. Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank there you. There is no rush. No rush. If, if you can see me, you put uh, Royal Zuros in. Royal Zuros. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna search it. I'm gonna search that tonight. Okay, that's, <laughs> okay. that would be nice. <laughs> I'm gonna listen to some it's song. A it's hey. a commercial. <laughs> and what yeah. happened with yeah, but, but what happened with your band? Uh, you. Unfortunately, uh, 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 others members of the I, I hear uh -huh. not a word. Not like song. I I'm not like I get into uh, um you know like happy the joys you know because mm -hmm. that's uh make you feel you no know, in peace you know before i used to to um when i used to um listen uh reggaeton or, uh -huh. or all kind of music i used to listen to get happy you know like small drink i see know? i see you know <laughs> that me sex, uh, music sex and rock and roll yeah. something like that uh -huh. yeah Music made me drink, you know, like alcohol or smoke, you know, like I weed see. or, yeah. Oh, I, see. No, I never, I never gave a meaning uh, to the music. I mean, uh, I enjoy music. I have enjoyed music, but without uh, inspiring, getting inspired for inspiration to drink or something like that. Yeah. Just uh, if I like uh, romantic music, if I listen to romantic music, uh, uh, I prefer some. Uh, I like some songs. Uh huh. Yeah. Some others not, but I don't get uh, fixed. Some others. I don't, I some don't others get. Don't. Uh, some others don't. But I don't get any fixation on the meaning. I mean, some some lyrics are beauty. Another lyrics are happy. Another lyrics, but I don't get the uh, stuck or 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 having a fixation on the on the yeah. on the lyrics i just enjoy actually i i'm i enjoy more the music than the lyrics uh -huh. yeah. It's, yeah it's okay it's kind of it's kind of weird because anyone has any how to say uh, gusto any Right, so we are starting to get back. Okay, guys, how how was your conversation about music? It was great. Great. Okay, nice. That's always a good topic, for good or for worse. Teacher. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay, we were talking oh. to. Hello. Uh huh. Tell me. Hello. Hello, uh, we were talking with uh, Francisco. I have a question. Mm -hmm. How do you say uh, género musical in English? I, I forgot that. Genre. I, I can't recall. <laughs> genre. Huh? Genre. Um, genre. Genre or types of music. Genre. Type of, types genre. of music. Uh, type of music. 
Type of music. Type, type of music. music. Genre. Okay. Or kinds of music. Yeah, it's, it's it's different different ways of saying it. Kinds of music. Kind of right, guys. So now that you got the hang of it, you were able to practice your listening comprehension. You were able to chat a little bit. Now it's time to get serious and go to grammar. All right. So okay. let's get it ready here. So go ahead and read with me, please. It's an objective. Lesson objectives. Lesson objectives. Lesson objectives. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and practice and practice passive to describe process. By the end of the lesson, the participants will be able to understand and practice passive to describe process. To describe process. To describe process. Good. I need a I need a volunteer to read it. Me, Francisco. Go ahead, Fran. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and practice passive to describe process. There you go. Now try to say it again one more time. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and practice passive to describe process. There you go. There you go. Thank you very much, Fran. All right. So, you're welcome. Let's get it ready here. Passive voice is not that complicated if you pay attention. <laughs> you really gotta pay attention oh, okay. to this one. <laughs> it's not that complicated. I'm here to help, but yeah, pay attention to it. Go ahead and mute your mics, guys. Please. Hello, in this lesson we'll study passive to describe process. Get your notebook and get ready to take notes. The passive to describe process is R plus past participle. A scene isn't filmed just once. Only the best shots are used. Modal plus B plus past participle. One scene may be shot from five or six different angles. Lots of different shots have to be taken. Before we begin, let me review the reasons for using the passive. Number one, we don't know who does the action. Number two, the doer of the action is not important. With this in mind, we will use the basic passive. In other words, be plus past participle. Work with me on this first sentence. A scene isn't filmed just once. Only the best shots are used. Did you notice the use of B plus past participles? We may also use passive with models. This is the rule. Model plus B plus past participle. One scene may be shot from five to six different angles. Are you able to describe a short process? You may use first, next, then and after to help you out. The passive. Number one, we don't know who does. Maybe shot from fun. Alrighty guys, so as I was mentioning before, this is not a complicated topic, but you really gotta pay attention to it. All right, so here, um, passive, as it was saying, is when you don't really, or in this case, is when you don't really know who the, the action or you don't mention it okay so here a scene isn't filmed just once we are not talking about who filmed only that that has happened okay now for uh -huh. example um to use this structure i don't know that if you know but when they paint a car normally and if you go to a, a nice um to a nice place a car isn't painted just once, right? It's como un vehículo no es pintado solamente una vez. A house isn't cleaned just once a month, right? Um, so yeah. to keep on this structure, remember as I always mention, once you have a structure, go ahead and practice it until you're good. Then you can start using it in, diff in other different um, areas. Now, who can give me an example using this one? 
is or are plus plus participle? For example, uh, more movies are made in India than in Hollywood. Okay, more movies are made in India than in India than Hollywood. I didn't know. <laughs> All right. Um, another one. When you say actually, my cell phone is broken. You are always using the past participle, right? And you're using it to describe. But in this particular one, only the best shots are used. Is solo las mejores escenas son usadas. So that's why you're going to be using the past participle. Now, what steps are there for a, I don't know, to prepare a Maruchan? Using the past participle. Have you ever eaten a Maruchan? Yes. Yeah. Yes, okay. <laughs> What in order steps? to have a maruchan, the first thing you gotta do uh -huh. is to put the water on the kit on the cooking stove uh -huh. and heat the water up. Uh, right okay. after that, but so uh, let's go ahead and do it in passive voice. Oh, I'm gonna use the chat right now. Uh, uh, okay, go ahead. Hey soup, hey soup. Like or in order to make the, the no. water is heated up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, the no, maruchan no. is there. cooked. The maruchan no. is cooked in water, or is boiled in water. You're almost there. Hey, How do you say hey, el agua? Soup. El agua es servida por cinco minutos. Using this. The water boiled is boiled, is boiled five for five minutes. minutes. Uh-huh, that's right. I heard Douglas saying is first water is boiled for five minutes. Five minutes. Right? First uh, yes. water if you use if you use a, a disposable uh, cup, mm -hmm. the microwave oven isn't mm -hmm. used. Yeah, microwave oven, well I'm not sure. Can we use can you, mean, have or you has? mean the normal maruchan just, in just the glass? Can we use has or have? Okay, you just, just eat you it for three minutes. Normally, you you're using the verb to be, just the verb oh, to, to be, be right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then once, the same example. Once the water, once the water has been boiled, you add the water to the maruchan. Mm -hmm. okay, yes, the water can and be let it, boiled. And let it and let minutes. it uh -huh. okay so what happens next we have water is boiled for five minutes now you tell me what happens next uh, ¿Qué pasa después? let it stay for 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 three minutes mm -hmm. Pero si la the water, water is served yeah. in a glass the water is the served in a glass no. the, con the content is put in a glass <laughs> guys what kind of maruchan no. do you eat <laughs> 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 Son avocado. Son avocado is placed in the maruchan. What happens? What happens after you boil the water? You pour the water into the maruchan cup, right? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. So how do you say that in, it, in in passive voice? The maruchan is shaking in the cup. Shaking. Yeah. 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 Ouch. <laughs> Water is poured Oscar, in the, in nice. the cup. Nice. In the cup. Then you can water can is okay. poured tomato in the cup. Nice. <laughs> then, the water is poured in the cup. Uh -huh. Water is poured in the cup. Nice. Then what happens next? It's let it stay for three minutes. Aha. Uh -huh. You let it sit or for three minutes. Mar and then Maruchan is eaten by uh -huh. me. Okay. <laughs> you can, you can, we can say that. <laughs> but now, how would you say luego la Maruchan is a for three minutes? What? Then, then let the, <laughs> let the Maruchan... The Maruchan is stayed. Let it stay. Is ready to cook. 
to eat. I, I'm sorry, to eat. It's to eat. Mars. <laughs> In Pasi work voice, can be it's not easy. After no. the Maruchan is, is, is the, and being seat for, for three minutes, is ready to eat. Okay, the, the I'm going to help you. Is, is let sit because we have to use another verb, right? And let is the same base, past, and past participle. And let's sit uh -huh. for five minutes. Okay, next. Yeah. Maruchan is let sit for five minutes. Es como que la, la dejan ahí. Que asiente. Que asiente. And is finally. Yeah. And finally. Ready. The Maruchan yeah, can be eating. Ready. The Maruchan is eating. Ready to eat. The Maruchan is eating by me. <laughs> mixed, mixed or shaking. Ma, ma, the Maruchan okay. is, is ready to eat. Ah, okay. It's mixed. Or ready to it's mixed. Or, it's mixed and for ready to be eaten. One minute. Okay. Why? Oh. One minute. Maruchan no, you, minute eaten so by me. You gotta, you gotta mix ah. it. Or steer. Next. That's another verb. Steer. Let's use it for next. The maruchan Later. is improved by adding some vegetables, <laughs> some avocado, some avocado. Tomato. Oh, avocado. guys, that's another one. The pronunciation uh -huh. is not avocado. I said that avocado. For, for several Avo years. Okay. It's avocado. Yeah, it's avocado. Avocado. It's like tomato. Uh, no, it's not tomato. It's tomato. Uh, well, uh, that, that's debatable. Tomato. Some people say it's tomato. tomato, tomato. <laughs> so, pues, some people say potato. Some other people say potato. Uh -huh. <laughs> Right okay. after. Finally, right after, I can eat. Once the maruchan. soup is being seated for five minutes, the soup is ready to be eaten. Low in the spoon. <laughs> right you after the maruchan the is eaten. Here. Finally, you can eat. The maruchan. You can eaten. You enjoy. It's ready enjoy to be eaten. It. Who wanted to eat the maruchan? Enjoy Somebody said it. Maruchan it. is eaten by me. He's <laughs> ready it to blow the spoon. Sulamita, did you say that finally the maruchan is eaten by me? Yes, I was. Okay, I was Demole, pues. Sulamita. <laughs> finally, the maruchan is eaten by Sulamita. So guys, congratulations. You just used passive voice to describe um, a process, right? Here but the have... passive voice in conclusion mm -hmm. is the verb is R and the pa and the passive and the past of the verb. And the past participle. Okay. Mm -hmm. Correct. To now, describe process. To describe process. What I wanted to do, guys, is yeah. to work in groups. Again, the idea is for you to talk as much as you can. And I wanted to describe a process. Okay. You can, right. I don't know, today I grilled some delicious jalapenos with quesillo inside and paprika on top. Recommended. Delicious. Super recommended. So, <laughs> yeah, I can say that the jalapeno is is cut, then uh, seeds are removed, right? Jalapeno is stuffed. Stuffed is relleno. It's a stuffed uh, with cheese, blah, stuffed. blah, blah. So, guys, in you got eight minutes. In eight minutes, I wanted to come up with a process on something being done like this. Describe a process, if you want, about food, now that we have been working on that, okay? Let's get right. ready, accept the invite, and you got eight minutes. At 55, I'll take you back. Oh, I missed the last week. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, so we print. can begin. We have to, I believe we have to get up to date and in, in the platform and that's it. Yeah. I I think so. And right now we need to talk in the past participle in the, mm -hmm. yeah. so let's begin. Uh, today, today, no, I don't know, uh, the hamburger are, was eaten by me. 
today uh, in order to celebrate Father's Day. In order to celebrate. Nice. Uh, and how, how did you prepare the, the, the burger? Exactly. There we go. Go ahead I, and describe it with pasta. Uh, the, the bread. Ah. <laughs> uh, the bread is, is, is the bought. Bread, it's bought at the supermarket. Yeah, the, the bro I bought the bread in the supermarket. Then, uh, I don't know, someone can help me in order to to explain it, how to make a burger. Let, let, me, let me continue. Uh, mayonnaise, mayonnaise is mayonnaise, mayonnaise. Mayo, yeah, like mayo, 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 aha, mayo, oh, mayo. Oh, mayo, like your mayo, 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 like mayo, mayo. Mayonnaise. French toast? French toast? Right. Is that tostada francesa? Mm -hmm. French toast. French toast. Uh, uh, the fears, uh, uh, the milk is uh, boiled for three minutes. Uh, then um, the milk is uh, poured in the, in the, what do you say, plat, plato? In a dish or a bowl, because and otherwise it's, it's, a, bowl? it's a bowl, a, on the it's a, bowl. It's a bowl beside uh, uh, that the bread in the in the in the bowl uh, you you can and, uh, and, and, come say I have um, a egg and um, make sure you what? keep the structure though <laughs> um, eggs are mixed uh -huh. mix, mix uh, the, the the eggs. Uh, um, la, later, um, the bread is. Um, what do you say? Uh, how do you say? How do you say? Um, uh, mezclar la la leche en el pan, como revolver, no sé. Bread, bread and milk are mixed. Bread and milk and milk. And mix are mixed. Okay. Are mixed. So are mixed. Let, me, let me check yeah. how another group is doing. Make sure you right. don't lose. You don't. You use the structure. Please. Okay. Side has to be put on the side. Uh, then I inhibit it. <laughs> You're hungry. <laughs> ginger, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> then the bread Sorry. has to be has I to be it. toasted. Has to be toasted. Toast. toast, 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 toast. Once, it's, once the sí. once the bread is tossed, wait, wait, wait. once the bread has been tossed, yeah. uh, wait, 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 wait. That's, that's what I call the 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 machine gun effect. Here yeah. we go with here we go again. Toasted, toasted. Every toasted. single verb that finishes in t or d, the sound of c or d at the end. In the end, in it's base like form, either. whenever you use the past tense, or in this case, the, the past participle, you're going to use id. For example, want finishes in t, wanted. In this case, toast, last sound is t, you're going to say toasted, id, toasted. toasted. Ahí está. Oh, sí. You may continue. Okay. Okay. Once the Sorry. bread has been toasted, you can add mayo. And ketchup. Once the ketchup and the mayo has been added, mm -hmm. uh, you had you must put the chicken on top. Remember that. Yeah, you're using but has. using the possible. Uh -huh. so you're using uh -huh. has. Make sure you use the verb to be is or are. First, water is boiled. Already done the. Yeah. Once the, the, the second step. Once right? the toast has been toasted. Uh -huh. uh, the chicken must be added. Once the chicken has been added, chicken must be uh, added. tomato, lettuce, and avocado must be added on top. And ginger. Uh, on, <laughs> on, the, on top, yeah. Once, no, I once, was talking to my sister. Once the vegetables are going to, are on, to make a, have, a tea for me. Okay, once the <laughs> vegetables have been placed placed on top of the chicken we add 
the last piece of bread has to be added. Once the last piece of bread has been added, the burger is ready to be eaten. Okay, but in that case, again, I'm sorry to stop you. Make sure that you use is, you're using has been. That's another structure. And it's great. It's great, Thomas. But okay. in order for you to, to master this, we got to practice it the way it is. Uh, what are you Let's cooking? See. I got confused. Burger. Okay, burger. Okay, so for example, uh, bread is toasted. Then mayo is added. Added. For example, I did it. I did. Um, the meat is cooked. So the idea is for you to use the subject, the verb to be, and then the verb in past participle. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's do it again. The kitchen. Once the chicken, once what, the well, chicken is. You got like the... 30 seconds. Okay. The chicken okay, is okay, cooked. Okay. okay. The bread is. All right, guys, now, now that everybody's back, I need a volunteer to share the steps, one per group. And uh, I want the person that had the most difficulties, not the one that had it easier. Mm -hmm. The difficult is, is, to, is to put the, uh, the mind of, of uh of the rule mm -hmm, exactly. and, uh, i have seen a, a, a passive basic or model as passive mm -hmm. all right show me one recipe please come on just one don't be afraid i got a class in four minutes <laughs> hurry up my recipe is to uh -huh. to prepare chicken soup uh -huh. and i was discussing with my partners that i how I can make a uh, chicken soup. Mm -hmm. And first of all, I take a pot and I put it in the fire in order to heat, heat it up. Okay, so we can say a pot is heated. A pot is heated, all right. Uh -huh. And after that, the water is put on the pot. Okay. And water is poured, poured. That would be the ver vertir. Uh -huh. That's right. All right. And the vegetables are mixed. Excellent. And they are, they are put on the pot too. Mm -hmm. And the kitchen as well, the, the chicken as well. Uh -huh. and, you, and you let it stay for about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. and, and the soup is done. Okay. To be eaten by you. Soup is done. Okay, the soup is done because we are using verbs. Great job, Douglas and your team. Excellent. Um, I need one more team, one representative for each team. Ed, mm -hmm. Oscar, I tried um, how to prepare a, a burger. Mm -hmm. First of all, the groceries groceries are bought at the supermarket. Mm -hmm. Then uh, uh, mayonnaise is spread uh -huh. main is mayo spread. mayo 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 is spread uh on the buns or buns buns uh, on the buns of bread uh, the like esos pedacitos. On, is, is, is that in or on on the bread so uh -huh. buns is uh pretty much the bollito de pollo uh -huh. and also for girls the the way they they come their hair a bun. Mm -hmm. Cuando se hacen el moñito aquí, that's a uh, bun too. A bun. Okay. Oh. Mayo is spread uh, on the bread. Mm -hmm. 
Um, uh, yeah, the, the party, the party, the party is uh -huh. is uh, is pride. Uh -huh. on, a, on a on a grill or no no you not fry on a grill or it's, it's fried on a pan. Uh -huh, on a pan. Yeah, uh, the patty is placed in the between the, the two pieces of bread. The buns <laughs> so, between the buns. Between the buns. Okay. The buns. In the buns. Uh, lettuce is added. Um, tomato is added. Onion is added. Pickle pickles are added. added. Uh -huh. Well, uh, I can recall who said tocino. Uh, no, ba bacon. I'm sorry. Bacon. <laughs> bacon. Don't worry. Bacon. bacon is all in in a uh, in a uh, French fries. A uh, slice of cheese or slice slice uh, of cheese. A uh, slice. slice of cheese also. Okay. Then the burger is served. 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 With uh, with uh, French, French fries. French fries. Uh -huh. Guys, I'm hungry because of you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, me all too. Right. So, so thank you very much. Good job. Um, remember, and the structure is difficult only at the beginning. Then little by little yeah. with practice, you start getting better and better and better. So that, that's all for today. Thank you very much for logging in uh, this special day to some of you. You know, congratulations to the ones that have the, uh, the blessing or, you know, the bad luck the of, being a, of being a father. But <laughs> I really hope that you have enjoyed <laughs> So guys, this is Alejandro right. Narbona on behalf of Inglés Corporativo. Get out of here. See you tomorrow. Thank you, teacher. Take care. Oh, Thank no. you. See you tomorrow. Good night, night everybody. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Bye.